Hello guys, in this video, I am going to show you how I countered Doroth. I use Assassin Emblem and Burst Build to counter him since it would be pointless to increase my defense since he can easily penetrate it. Increasing my HP is okay but his damage would still be enough to kill me. So I am going to counter him using damage instead. Using this tactic would require prediction and analyzation. In the early game, try to play safely if the enemy Doroth is harassing you and use your first skill to last hit enemy minions. When you reach level 2, you can start harassing him as well, just by hitting him using skills and dashing away from him. In this moment, I can't see where the Doroth is, but he forced to cut off the lane earlier, so it is pretty obvious that he is going to steal the red buff. When this happens, prevent him from taking it and ask for your team's help. In this moment, our jungler is about to approach and it would be impossible for us to kill Doroth, since he can easily escape using his dashing skills, so what I am going to do here is to stop his movement first so Fredrin can approach him. When Doroth dashed towards you, then stop it using your second skill, that way, he can't cast his skills continuously. After that, you can either dash away or dash to reposition yourself, it depends on the situation. In this moment, I am going to use all of my skills so I can clear the wave faster since the turtle is about to respawn. That way, Doroth will be forced to sacrifice the wave if he is going to contest the turtle. We'll take care of everything. Initiate retreat. Looking good. Initiate retreat. In this moment, Doroth will have no choice but to farm to jungle or other lane. It seems that provoking him was a good choice. Now, he will force himself to try to kill me.
In this moment, I sense that the enemy is about to gank here so I signaled Estus to retreat, but it seems that she didn't notice it. Because of it, Estus will die. My mistake here is that I can't leave her alone. Hoo hoo hoo. As time goes by, my phone will start to heat up so you will notice some heavy FPS drop later on. This is due to my ultra refresh rate settings and 60 FPS screen recorder.
Well, we lost. But this video is not about winning, but it is about teaching you what to do when you are facing against Aroth. I hope you learned something. Thank you for watching. is my craft diggy is my name happy easter everyone you can finally get the easter egg skin of diggy fairy tailor in this event you just have to flip those cards first flip will cost 10 diamonds and the price will keep increasing as you flip more cards but the chances of getting lucky card will also increase when you get three lucky card you can exchange it for diggy easter epic skin but you can also choose other epic skin if you are not a diggy user Let's try using its new skin in a classic match and build Burst Mage. Okay. 